What's up guys? Oh What's up guys? Oh Oh yeah <laughs> Had y'all fucking fool for a second there, didn't I? Got that green screen shit. You thought that was me? Y'all, you guys beat the world to me. Don't unsubscribe, no! But yeah, that intro had <laughs> nothing to do with what we're gonna talk about today. But what we are gonna talk about is something that you probably already know because of the title. Karaoke! Now, if you don't know me personally, you might not know that I enjoy going out to karaoke a couple times a week. And I've gone to plenty of different places, but I do have my favorite spots that I go to at least once a week. And it's been going on for about a year and a half now. So I'm basically gonna be talking about some reasons why everyone should do karaoke. It's some of the best fun you'll ever have. Now the main reason a lot of people don't wanna actually go out and sing karaoke is because of stage fright. Now that was me for the first couple of years that I was able to go out to bars and drink. In 12th grade, I had sung in front of people at the talent show and it had been at least three years at that point when I turned 21 and especially before that, I was absolutely petrified of even being in front of people, let alone singing. I've always loved singing, but my nerves got the better of me. And that brings me to my first point on why everyone should do karaoke, and that is no one really cares how bad you sing, especially when they're drunk, because that makes it even more fun. And I gotta tell you a story about two people, I'm not gonna name their names, but they go around places that I go, so everywhere that I go, I'll see them, at least karaoke-wise. Because they have some sort of gimmick, and this, <laughs> this gimmick is that they wear karate robes. The guy wears a yellow one, the girl wears a pink one. They have their stage names embroidered on the back, and they go around singing. They're both not that good. And people may judge you in their heads, like uh, a lot of people do with them, including myself. But no one's gonna outright come up to you and be like, hey dude, you fucking suck. No one's gonna go booing you off the stage, and after every single song that everyone sings, I always hear clapping, no booing. And at the end of the day, no one's opinion matters but your own, because them. <laughs> now my next point on why everyone should do karaoke is that if you actually are a good singer, then you might be approached by other musicians slash singers, and these people might either want to start a band with you, start a group with you, maybe even do some like recording if that's your thing, you know what I mean? Like if, if you want to like join with like a producer and do some music with them. And even if nothing does come to fruition, people can still be supportive of you and stuff like that. And you could be supportive of their music if they tell you about it. Depending on where you are, like if you're in a big city like LA or New York or something like that, and you do karaoke and the right person's there, that might be your big break. Now I personally have never had an experience like that, but it's still a possibility. So shoot your shot, go out there, do some karaoke, show off your pipes. This isn't even a fucking Hydra Flask. Visco girls are gonna be the fucking death of me someday, I swear to God. Now it's time for a quick plug. I unplugged my weed just for that joke. But the plug I'm really gonna be talking about is the plug for my Patreon. If you didn't already know, I have a Patreon and that actually is the best way that you can support my dream of becoming a full-time YouTuber, which means more regular content because uh, this uh, <laughs> I tried doing a video once a week and it already has fallen off the wagon because it's been a few weeks since <laughs> since I last uploaded. I'm just, <laughs> let's just put that out there. I'm, I'm not doing a good job with that. Even a dollar a month helps and uh, I will thank you forever. I will say thank you to you every day. I will DM you. I will come to your house. I will <laughs> whisper in your ear. Thank you so much. <laughs> so yeah, Patreon. See what perks you can get, and if you like it, and you can afford it, do it. <laughs> and the most important reason that I personally think that everyone should do karaoke, because it has impacted me the most, is that you can make some great friends. Because a bunch of people that just love singing, that all get together on a pretty regular basis, at least once or twice a week, you form a certain special bond that only karaoke has seem to do. I've made plenty of acquaintances while doing karaoke, so I know a bunch of people that I never would have known <laughs> if I hadn't gone. Then I have the few people that have remained good friends to this day, a year and a half later. And you guys know who you are, so if you're watching this video, you guys are fucking awesome. Because I'm normally an introvert, but 
when I do go out, it's a good time and I can make friends pretty easily. Fun is the number one thing about karaoke, but not only that, you can support your bartenders, your local bars, and your local DJs. And stick around to the very end of the video where I'm gonna shout out some bars that I go to. So, in summary, karaoke is just an all around great time. You can make good friends and it'll help you overcome some fears like stage fright. And if you're pretty introverted, it can also get you over the fear of talking to strangers. And like I said, this is the very end of the video where I shout out some places that I go to for karaoke at least once a week. And I'm gonna put them in the description below with the addresses because I don't have them on hand right now because I didn't plan that ahead of time. And if you're in the area, go to these places on those days and you'll most likely see me there and we can sing together. We can do a duet, we can sing fucking like a whatever you want, you know? <laughs> as long as I know it. And on Wednesdays is one of the best places that I've ever been to for karaoke because it's the first, so, you know, you always gotta cherish that in your heart. And that place is Villanova West. Um, bartender, Carrie. She's great. If you go there, tip her well. And the DJ, he goes by Babes. He's a great guy, and uh, he's a very talented musician in general. He can play all sorts of instruments, and man, he got some pipes, dude. So, uh, yeah, if you go there, don't be surprised when he starts belting. Then we also got on Wednesday nights, the Belvedere Inn, where Sid is the DJ. I don't really know any of the bartenders' names because I rarely go there, and it's always kind of packed. But anyway, we got DJ Sid. Um, he's definitely one of my favorite DJs, as well as Babes, uh, because uh, he also does the Thursday night, which is probably my favorite karaoke night because it's a cool place. But yeah, check that out too. And then on Thursday nights, that's another big night because I go every week, and that is Altana Rooftop Lounge, which kind of sounds weird to say like in the winter time, but they have a third floor bar too, so it's not always on the rooftop. But the rooftop's pretty fucking cool because when <laughs> you're on the roof, you're singing karaoke, people down on the streets of Lancaster, you know, they can hear you singing. It's, it's kind of exhilarating. <laughs> but the third floor is good too because it's just a giant space, and it's just a chill place. Man, I should make some fucking raps, you know what I mean? You know what I'm talking about? Because I just rhymed there, because I'm fucking awesome. <laughs> Let's, uh, okay. Yeah, these lyrics are shit. And like I said, Sid is also the DJ on uh, Thursday nights at Altana. And yeah, uh, Joey, the bartender there, one of the best fucking bartenders that I've ever had and he's become one of my good friends too. I will leave the uh, addresses to each of the bars below and if you're in the area and you like doing karaoke or you want to try it out for the first time, I'll be there. So uh, yeah, Wednesdays and Thursdays, Villanova West on Wednesdays, Altana on Thursdays, those are the two likely places that you'll see me if you do go out. So with that, that's it for my time guys. Remember to like the video, subscribe if you're new here, and comment down below any karaoke spots in your town that you might want me to try out if I ever visit. And if you are going to visit, or if you're just like in the area, comment down below if you might want to come out because I'll look out for you. So, yeah. And I will see you guys next time.